guys. So we move on to our next story, where Casey's future is with Diva. The content creator's future might be with the metaverse. Now, Project Nightfall reveals that the future of content creation is the metaverse. Now, the metaverse can be used to affect billions of lives. That's what Aegon Hare, aka Project Nightfall, had very recently said. Now, the Polish YouTuber Aegon Hare, known for his educational videos under the handle Project Nightfall on socials, boasts of over 14 million followers collectively and already knows where the future of his company lies in the metaverse, of course. And many people fear the shift, surmising that the metaverse will turn humans into headset-wearing zombies. Do you fear that? Do you see that? Yeah, it does concern me that we will, um, you know, be more anxious about like the outside world when we can live so much in this whole new world just yeah. from sitting on a couch. Yeah, that does concern me actually. That's insane. So to clear those misconceptions, Egon took the stage at NAS Summit and exclusively spoke to Love in Dubai on the multiverse. Uh, the ace content creator who's managed to crack the code on what works in the cyber world strongly predicts that the metaverse will in fact take off in the near future and is looking to utilize the space for humanitarian work, which is so interesting. Now, the first and top benefit that he mentioned is the metaverse can help eliminate corruption. And the fact that every single transaction made in the metaverse is traceable can help eliminate corruption altogether and second the metaverse is like a video game where you can earn hundreds of thousands of dollars remotely which is uh, a dream job for <laughs> many 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 people and thirdly he said the metaverse has the power to bridge the gap between the first world and the third world countries to make resources more accessible and timely to those in need i basically believe that for many of us who hear meta in the metaverse and kind of the facebook becoming meta and We're still, the majority of us, okay, maybe I'm just speaking for myself, I'm not aware of the capabilities of what it could mean. Exactly. And I think that he was trying to summarize that in a way that makes sense to us, which is really cool. I mean, of course, anything up and coming, you see the benefits and you see the cons. And then you also see like, for, for me, for example, like when I heard about the metaverse and when I tried it out, it's just like, we always had virtual reality headsets, right? like for the longest time and people could wear them and they would be transported to another world where they would be inside of like the cyber space. And it's basically the same thing. But I thought recently it's just hyped and they call it the metaverse. And it's just, you know, people are focusing and targeting more on that and trying to grow that space. But we've always, I think we've always had. We've always had it, but not to the extent that it's going to be. So rather than like you're sitting in Zoom, you're going to pop on your... VR yeah. and you'll be sitting in a meeting room with someone in San Francisco so you'll much more have that like real life effect I'm trying to think how will this show be done in the metaverse so mm. I'll be sitting at home mm. and can, do, is it an outfit if people can see your body you'll be sitting at home and everyone watching will be sitting at home however we'll all feel like we're in a live room together But that so actually it will <clears throat> potentially bridge the gap between us and you, maybe because we'll actually all feel like we're in the same space, rather than yeah. that this space here between the cameras will be eliminated. But essentially, and also like we could like we could do a lot more with this graphics. Like this is pretty basic. We can, we can have a waterfall behind we can us. Have a waterfall, a space, fountain. Oh my god, yes, a galaxy. I don't know, like literally anything, black hole or something. Yeah. That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we can do. Like, this is the capabilities that we can potentially start looking at. And then everything that we create can be sold as tokens and coins. And oh, look at that. Speaking 